Hey, I'm Charting Man Dan. If you like this video, I encourage you to check out our website, thechartguys.com, home of technical analysis, learning, and education, where we broadcast live market coverage every morning, provide live chart consultation, and point out key levels on your favorite plays in our community chat room. Why not check out our free trial and join the best technical analysis community? We have oil on the daily and weekly time frame and starting to look toppy. So we have a bearish reversal, grave or not a gravestone doji, just a regular old doji there, but at the top of an uptrend. That is bearish. We've got the upper Bollinger Band rejecting the price two days in a row. If we see a red day tomorrow, ideally breaking the low of today, 42.58, that will be a bearish signal and we'll be headed down to the 200-day moving average of 41.10. Just a reminder again that stock charts has moved on to the May contracts, but the price action is relatively the same. So bearish reversal on the daily, looking for downside tomorrow. Weekly time frame. Upper Bollinger Band rejecting the price on both the daily and the weekly. And we have this 50 week resistance right there at 44.03. So, looking for some temporary consolidation, we'll look for 41.10 to act as support. And a red day tomorrow will confirm that reversal. That being said, we are clearly still in an uptrend here on the daily chart. And we could pull back, and as long as a higher low is set compared to this 35.46 level, 35.24, it will still be maintaining that higher low pattern. And then we'll be looking back up to set those higher highs. So oil bulls had a very nice move. The fact that we did break the previous high on the bounce does show that strength. But after, let's see here, five of the last six days were bullish. Need to see some consolidation. Thechartguys.com is the website. Free trial, no credit card required. New website coming on Friday. Hope you'll check it out. I appreciate you watching the video and hope you have a great night.